Hey guy, today's video I'm going to share with you one of the another equations that used to appear in Cambodia outstanding mathematics competition in 2000s. If you want to know how to solve this, watch this video until the end. Alright, to begin with, we have to look at the problem one times again. Like you can see the problem on the right hand side, let me point out for you and read the problems one times again. So in here they want us to solve the equation, right? They give the equation right here, but a little tough since you see x to the power of 2000 plus square root of 6x to the power of 1998 equal to square root of 2 plus square root of 3x to the powers of 1999s. Technically, if we solve without, a, you know, without thinking about the trick, we cannot solve it easily because it has 2000 root in there. Okay, 2000 root in there, there are a lot. So in order to make it easy, we have to look at this together. So let me write the problem one times again, right? Okay. So technically in this part, you see something here. So I move um, this side, the second side, into the first side. So in here, since you see in front of that is a plus sign, but naturally we don't write it. When it moves to the opposite side, you have minus. Or possibly you can, you can minus both sides. It's square root of 2 plus square root of 3x to the power of 1999. The same, all right? So see now see the common factors in here where where x equal to 1998 it's the smaller the smaller power in there okay it's smaller common factor so i take this as a common factor over there so the remain over over there is x squared and this one when i take um x to the power of 1998 it remain only square root of six and here it remain x another one so if you times this together into the brackets, so you get the same, okay? You get the same, so which is not really difficult. So in order to solve for this problem, we have to give the equations. So the first part you make into zero and another part into zero to make it, you know, um, you know, it's just the identities of the equation, or the basic. So I could get two of this, okay? And this one, the top one, you can possibly get x equal to zero, okay? You can get x equal to zero. In here, it's simple, right? So in here, I could get x into zero, but the second one is a little tough there. So we have to solve for, for it. So let me tell you how to solve this together. So in here, maybe you remember how to solve by using data, right? Okay, data equal to base square minus 4ac, and the root is x equal to minus 4 plus or minus square root of data over 2. So technically, this one, since so I know it is b, okay, and this one is c. And this one over there is a. So I use data to solve this problem. Okay, so b square minus 4, 4, 4, a times c. So a1 here times c square root of 6, so I got this. And then I break through this, and I got this. Okay, I got this. But technically, that term here, we want to make it into square root of that. So in order to make it easy to get it out from the square root, we have to make this one into perfect square okay in order to make it into perfect square I, I can make it into like this so when I break it through it get the same like this possibly it's easy right okay okay let's move to this side let's continue to that part so if I know the value of that tar I can get the value of x1 okay so whether it is b minus square root of that tar. so since I know that when I break through the square root of that half it's square here, so I got the remain this over 2. So I plus and minus, so I get square root of 2 here. So the second one, which is easy. So um, here I got this, and 
when I plus and minus, so I got square root of 3, and that's the case. So that's all for our part. So I get the solution here, where x equal to 0 in the first part, and the second part x equal to square root of 2, and x equal to square root of 3. And that's the answer for this problem. Okay, I hope you learned something from this video. So if you like this video, don't forget to click subscribe in order to get more math tip outstanding problem. And thank you for watching.